right. Okay, guys. Uh, so let's begin. So Narendra, uh, you are looking for online academic. Anuj also looking for online academic. So yes, basic, right. Yeah. So Sir, basics I know, but uh, I know the strategy how you teach. I know only. I yeah, want yeah, to know only that. Just uh, yeah, just. So I'll, I'll cover a little bit about the thing what we are covering. Uh, sorry, guys, there was an interruption. A couple of other people joined. Is my voice audible to all of you? There was a network glitch, actually. Yes, sir. We can. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Okay, okay, sorry for that. So quickly, guys, I'll go through the things what you will get. First of all, highly qualified trainers will be there every day, Monday to Friday, Zoom. Classes will be there. Saturday, you'll get a mock test, full-fledged mock test, and you will get evaluation. One mobile application we will provide in which you can review our past recorder session and your own recorder sessions as well. For an example, if you miss any class, you'll be able to review your class by next day. Another thing, we provide you one LMS account, digital account, in which you can practice more than 160 tests of IELTS Academic plus IELTS GT as well. So I'll show you this practice account uh, with a live interface. Practical account dedicated mobile as well. So you can operate this digital account from your uh, regular, your mobile as well. Regular assignments will be there every day. You'll get homework once you will complete it you'll get evaluation as well. Five full length mock test. So guys, this is the kind of account that we will provide you. Quickly, I will show you the interface, how it would look like. So guys, this is the account. Uh, is it visible to all of you? When your English logo is on the left side, Gursimran, you need to uh, activate your mic. Kindly click, click on the bottom left side of your mic. So Anuj, Kurpreet, Narendra, is this screen visible to all of you? Yes, sir. Okay, so yes. you, will get, you will get this kind of account. This is an LMS account. Once you will click on online test, you will be able to see IELTS Academic, IELTS Journal. This account will be validate for six months, whether you are going to enroll for one month or two months. You'll get the material for six months. See, every day classes will be there. This is an addition to the classes so that you can practice at home as well. So you can crack aisles within a month. This is the strategy behind it. So if you click on aisles academic, you will see item wise test, listening flow chart, listening form, multiple choice question, listening, you know, map, diagram sentences all kind of questions will be there you'll be able to see these are the full-fledged question 10 question 10 minutes once you take test you'll you will find specific type of question in this item wise test if you click on cd IELTS mock you'll be able to see complete mock test just like real cd IELTS and it's of 151 minute, 82 question. Once you will complete listening, reading will start automatically. Once you'll finish with reading, 
writing will start automatically and then uh, speaking will start automatically. Speaking is totally AI based, artificial intelligence based and entire test will be evaluated by AI as well. And if you click on this reading strategies, we have added quality videos here. How, uh, you know, these are the strategies, reading strategies, matching heading. So every person having his or her own weakness, weak point. So by watching these videos, like if you are feeling, you know, uh, difficulty and true and false, you can review these videos. These are the full fledged videos. And if you click on academic readings, you will be able to see there are five sections. Every section further going to be have five full length readings. Full length reading means 40 questions, 60 minutes. So one, two, three, four, and five. Every test would be of the diff different kind of level, difficulty level, easy, hard, medium, because you never know uh, what kind of exam will be there in the real IELTS exam. So we have uh, accumulated all types. So five into five, you going to have 25 full length readings over here. Every reading 60 minutes and you will find the real kind of IELTS experience here. Similarly, if you click on listening strategies, you'll be able to see all listening videos, listening tips, tricks here. F and if you click on listening section, you'll be able to find another five section on listening and every section going to have five full length listenings, 40 questions, 30 minutes of the different levels. So five into five, you're going to have 25 full length listenings here. Similarly, writing strategies will be there, how to describe a map, describe a flow chart and uh, these are the again academic writing tasks and every task is further going to be have five different levels of writing. Two question means writing task one, writing task two. It's going, you're going to be have 60 minutes to attempt these tasks. And once you click here, like take the test, it will take you further. Similarly, speakings are there. All speakings are AI based. First, you will find the speaking strategies and then you'll be able to find like complete 14 minutes speaking. So whatever you will see, um, artificial intelligence will be uh, evaluating. Similarly, if you click on journal, you would have enough journal material. Journal mock test, itemized, uh, item wise test, reading strategy, writing strategies, and entire stuff is there. Apart from this, if you go into learning zone, challenge zone, you will be able to see all the grammatical concepts over there. So you'll be able to hone your grammar skills over there. So grammar, noun, pronoun, verb, entire material is there. Apart from this vocabulary is there, verbal reasoning, reading comprehension, lots of stuff is there. There. And this account will be validate for six months. Even once you will clear your exam, you can pass on this, you know, uh, uh, credential, its credentials to your friends or families. And in this account, we have summarized this. Uh, every one of you also got this kind of sheet in which you can see 40 item wise full length test, listening, reading, five full length. CD IELTS mock test that you're going to get, 10 reading strategy video, 9 reading uh, listening strategy video, 8 writing strategy videos, 1 speaking is there, and uh, full readings, 60 minute, total 25 test of reading, 25 listening, 25 uh, writing tests you will find, consisting of almost thousand thousand reading and listening questions 50 full writing task and these are the grammatical concepts that you're going to get so this is the description you you i'm pretty sure you all uh, get in your whatsapp uh, messages so guys any confusion regarding this practice test that you're going to get all clear 
sir after taking a mock test there is a evaluation by a teacher or a, a ai ai mostly ai okay. and there is a self evaluation as well um if if you'll if you'll attempt mock test from here there is as a self evaluation as well you'll get a nine band answer and once you will attempt nine band answer will pop up as well if your trainer will share you the mock test then your evaluation will be done by our trainer so basically we'll make a whatsapp group in which we'll add all of you guys and our groups are not like you know 50 people are there it's like 6 to 8 maximum so that you you will get one to one kind of interaction because it's a value chain if we'll provide you better services definitely you'll we'll recommend other people right so it's it's our uh, predominant uh, you know uh, motive that to provide you the best services so that you prepare your ielts in a better way so this is the kind of uh, mobile application that we will provide you which you can re review the previous videos as well so this is the online ielts structure guys uh, journey from first week till fourth week uh it will rotate but the material will not be uh, rotated you will get fresh material in every month whether you going to join for two months or three months like on monday uh, in the class so every class will be of one and half hour basically because uh, one person cannot concentrate more than one and half hour on screen either you know trainer or the student that's why we build the uh, this digital account so that your trainer will allot you the stuff for the homework for the self practice as well for an example on monday we do listening full fledged listening plus speaking reading and writing task 2 will be from home tuesday writing task 2 will be discussed in detail speaking will be there listening writing task 2 will be from home wednesday writing task 1 speaking will be uh discussed reading listening will be homework see the benefit of digital count is you can prepare uh, you can practice even double practice at home if you want to uh, go through all the four sections you can do that similarly thursday friday saturday there will be full length mock test sunday we share a uh, study material blogs pdfs videos and tips so that you all uh, you know get a good uh, enough material and uh, uh, vocabulary connectors and relevant material this is kind of uh, you know evaluation you will get as per ielts idp standard task achievement coherence and cohesion lexical resource grammatical range and accuracy so a trainer will give you bands as per the idp standards so you will get this kind of evaluation once you will share any of your task in the group instructed by the trainer uh, you'll get the respective evaluation for that so guys uh, i'm just going to show you how our listenings will be there just give me a second please okay so initially at every uh, you know startup your trainer will show you some tips and tricks he or she will explain you what type of listening questions will be there and how to attempt what are the you know hooks and tricks where you can solve once see if you would have any certain sort of trouble like you you are facing trouble in a map kind of questions you can ask your trainer you would have full freedom to ask your queries he or she will be able to resolve that and after that you'll get this kind of listening so your trainer will play this video from first till 40th i'm just going to play it for just 5 10 seconds you'll come to know the quality of the uh, sound so just let me know if you hear or not listen carefully and answer questions 1 to 6 hello pembroke cycling holidays bob speaking oh hello So was it sound audible to all of you guys? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. So basically, your trainer will first ask you to write down one to forty numbers on your notepad. So 
so once you will write down 1 to 40 numbers on your notepad this video like this kind this kind of video will be played and you will read and listen and you will you going to write down the answers on your notepad once you will write all the answers from first till 40th then the real answers will be shown to you by your trainer from first till 40th he or she will dictate you all the answers and for an example, uh, you got 27th wrong. Instead of E, you got B. You can ask your trainer, I got B and why this is E. Then he or she will go back to that specific, 26 specific question, 27 specific question, and explain you uh, the basic concept behind that. So that your query will be resolved at the same spot. Similarly, in the reading interface, First, your trainer will update you what kind of reading questions will be there. And after that, he or she will update you the tips and tricks, how to sort these kind of questions. And then the real uh, kind of uh, reading will be there at your front. So you would get 10 minutes to solve one reading. So first, he or she will update you how to scanning, skimming, how to read the questions, how to uh, you know, mark the keywords, you will get 10 minutes. So once you will get all the answers with you, and then the real answers will be shown to you by your trainer. And again, if you will feel like you have some wrong answers, you would have right to ask your trainer, I got 13th B and why this is A, then he or she will go back to that specific questions or paragraph and update you uh, why this is the right answer. And explain you the reason behind this any doubt till this guys no sir, no, sir. okay so in the ielts writing part so basically there are four sections on behalf of these four sections your ielts writing score uh, will be evaluated first is task achievement and response coherence and cohesion, lexical resource, grammatical range, and accuracy. Now, what is, you know, task achieve, achievement and response? That means how are you going to achieve the task? How are you going to respond to the question? Like if they're asking about the hills and you're going to write down about the, you know, forest, you're going to write down about bridges that's going to be irrelevant so you have to be uh, relevant uh, including task achievement also include whether you're going to cover 250 words in writing task two or not whether you write down 150 words in you know writing task one or not coherence and cohesion is also linking the words whether you're going to use those linkers or not like firstly secondly thirdly or finally um, connectors should be there which basically link the paragraphs so there should not be jumbled paragraphs lexical resource means the type of vocabulary that you're going to use so some people use you know super glorious vocabulary very high vocabulary which is not even relevant to the subject so vocabulary should be relevant to the subject material then only you'll get desired band so every interface like these are four interface. Band score is calculated from zero to nine. Now, grammatical range and accuracy is also very important part. Grammatical range and accuracy means whether you're going to include all type of sentences or not, like simple sentence, compound sentence, compound complex or complex sentences, passive voice. So once you will complete or include all type of sentence structure in your writing, then you'll get nine band or eight band or seven band of grammatical range and accuracy so how score is going to be calculated basically for an example if you get seven bands here six here seven here six here then everything going to be added and divide by four that is going to be your real a band score. So this is how the uh, basically band is going to be evaluated. 
in the real time scenario any confusion in this guys sir in no, sir. sir how sir how many lexical resources are to be added in one writing task too basically there are uh, 10 to 12 you know good vocabulary words should be there in order to get uh, good bands in lexical resource but make sure those words should be aligned to the topic if they are like out of the topic or some because sometimes words can change the meaning entire meaning of the passage so sometimes we put so emphasized on the words rather than on the meaning so uh, you need to be very cautious about it so we have selected uh, you know uh, some couple of uh, lexical resources that we provide during our program if you use those words if you you know utilize those words into your speaking or writing definitely your lexical resource will be improved any other question no sir okay all clear to all of you three anuj gur yes, simran sir. yes sir yes sir okay what about gur simran yes sir okay thank you all right so guys during uh, writing task 2 your trainer will introduce you all type of writing task not only one type will be discussed so every day there will be new type like opinionating essays will be there where you have to share your own opinion advantage disadvantage essays will be there where you have to cite down uh, cite the uh, advantages what are the disadvantages discussion essays solution essays direct question essays so you going to be uh, you know get all type of uh, questions so this is the structure guys to get higher bands in writing task 2 we basically follow and practice this structure intensively and most of our students are getting wonderful bands you can check on our social medias as well so introduction is having basically three integral parts background information or general comment background information means like in yester years people or masses used to wear simple clothes so yesterday years jaise purane samay mein log simple kapde pehante the right so you are basically bringing the stuff from the past till present and uh, general comment is like nowadays people wear sophisticated clothing due to these you know many factors then plus paraphrase the topic paraphrase basically you have to convert the question into your own words so you basically convert the question into different words after the third part is thesis statement thesis statement basically tells the examiner what you going to, what you going to do further so let's discuss about these factors in subsequent paragraphs that is a thesis statement so basically body paragraph you have to write down two to three body paragraphs it it, it depends upon the demand of the question so now in body paragraph what you need to write down some people add so many points like 10 15 20 points examiner knows that there are thousands millions of point on one subject but they don't want you to add all the points they just want to add you one point explain it well support it with example once you will exemplify once you will support your point write down one point elaborate it support it with example that's it so you'll be done with the paragraph add some connectors good heading words so one to two paragraph will be enough again some people add third paragraph as per the demand of the question so if you will use this strategy simple and straight you will definitely get higher bands in conclusion you need to sum up the entire gist of the essay or you can rephrase your opinion whatever you have cited here you paraphrased in the first paragraph introduction you can rephrase here 
so entire uh, writing task 2 should not be less than 250 words if you will not uh, achieve 250 words you will not get the bands of task achievement and response if your paragraph would be jumbled you would not get the good bands of coherence and cohesion if you will not use connectors if you will not use good or relevant lexical you will not get their lexical resource similarly if you will not include the good types of uh, you know sentence structure then you won't get the good uh, grammatical inaccuracy points any doubt in this guys no sir so after that uh, this kind of uh, basically question will be given to you all you will be given five minutes to write down so you will get five minutes to write down the points only uh, here the points are already written but in the real class you won't get these points at front so your trainer will help you to brainstorm these points because what happens in the real ielts exam we feel that most of the student feel blank over there like they're not getting enough point right so our brainstorming session this is called brainstorming session our session help students a lot when our student you know go and take your exam in the real aisles they, they feel they have abundance you know of points with them so basically you'll get a statement you'll get five minutes and your trainer will ask you one by one what are the advantages or disadvantage demands of the question so you guys will dictate and your trainer will write it down all the points on the screen so once you'll have all the points he or she'll ask you to write down okay you have this much time write down your paragraphs and once you will write down the real answer will be shown to you by the trainer he or she'll give you the technical details how to write down thesis line how to write down opening line how to write down paraphrase you know how to uh, write down paragraphs so he or she'll take you through the entire journey and if he or she'll give you a written task to write it down you need to share it in the group and then you'll get a proper evaluation so this is you know online classes are not like offline classes you need to be very disciplined you need to have a flame or a flame to achieve or to crack the sound then only you'll be able to crack it after that every day you'll get speaking guys so we basically pick speaking and writing every day we don't miss speaking and writing every day because uh, majority of uh, students face difficulty in writing and speaking phase so in speaking again you will get uh, you know one topic and one by one everyone will uh, you know your trainer will start taking classes from one to one it's not like fish market everyone is speaking no only one uh, student and trainer will be on the interface and rest of the student will listen so everyone uh, you know trainer will suggest you to pose every time pose a new point so he or she will give you five or six minutes or seven minutes and one by one the the person who would like to you know uh, who completes the task can leave uh, the class if he or she wished to so this is the structure guys uh, that we basically build and this is very successful structure once you will start learning guys this is very interactive learning and definitely it will add value to your uh, learning any any point or any question guys you have on the structure sir for reading strategy any tips and tricks for if there is a more and more queries and see and there uh, is a daily class and there is no daily classes of reading if there is a more problem in reading see you you will get uh, reading assistance uh, you will be getting reading assignment every day for sure right but every day if your trainer will do reading it's going to be very boring right but you'll get reading assignment every day you can discuss your problem reading problem with the trainer mm -hmm. you would have personal contact of the trainer as well once you'll find any difficulty he or she will be able to guide you see reading is a game of practice uh, anuj i would suggest start reading newspaper every day i got even i got nine out of nine reading due to this habit 
so once you inculcate your reading habit reading is it it won't be an issue for you um okay, like good. you will but yeah. in reading it's so tough to score 9 no it's not tough like once if if you build a good speed um every time when i give exam because we often you know test ourselves as well so mera 10 15 minute exam normally khatam ho jata pehle hi so it depends how you know how much you have worked on your skills so reading is the major issue in punjab if we see because people have forget to read books so i would say every day start i read, read aloud. books i read books many of the novel then do But one then activity after the... do yes. one activity i would i would suggest you to enhance your reading but i you know do on a regular basis well, well i'm a good reader newspaper and other books for you i would suggest uh, at front of mirror start reading newspaper every day like one and half hour or two hour read aloud uh, reading newspaper will help you in many ways first of all your vocal uh, cord will be corrected your fluency will be enhanced secondly uh, you'll get to know new sentence structure in newspaper you'll get to know new vocabulary jot down those vocabulary on your uh, you know any uh, journal or in any book find out the meaning of that specific vocabulary use that vocabulary next day into your speaking and writing in this way uh, your writing will be enhanced as well third once you will start reading every day first five six days it will be very difficult like a hell task for you after that your eyes will be identified those words and your speed will be enhanced automatically and you will find the whatever the academic readings you guys feel difficult it's going to be very easy once you will build that kind of attention yeah so far you answered your question any other question gursimran gursimran aapka koi question hai no sir no 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 so anuj gursimran narendra हमारी क्लासेस फर्स्ट से स्टार्ट हो रही हैं बिकॉज आर ऑल ट्रेनर्स आर ऑन हॉलीडेज दीज डेज ड्यू टू न्यू ईयर सो टुडे इज ट्वेंटी सिक्स यू कैन एनरोल योर सेल्फ गाइज बेसिकली अर्लियर वी वर प्रोवाइडिंग द सेम कोर्स इंक्लूडिंग दिस अकाउंट फॉर सिक्सटी फाइव हंड्रेड इंक्लूडिंग एल एम एस अकाउंट the digital account that i showed and all the services that we provide but now we are providing 1500 off and the same services everything will be in 499 so those who wish to join just text me hi on the you know uh, just share your email on the same uh, uh, whatsapp where you got the link and one of our team member will get back to you by phone so what about uh, what about uh, listening uh, for a map listening map yeah one by one your trainer will cover each and every mostly no, no. okay uh-huh. yeah okay you will you will get uh, uh, and radha ma'am will be there she is having more than 17 year of experience in the english domain so once you will start uh, getting training from her you will feel the difference you can read our reviews many of our you know, student wrote about in radha ma'am uh, she's an amazing trainer any question uh, gursimran anuj no, no no sir no no okay. so we will provide you entire material guys and uh, support and after that we will provide you uh, study abroad services as well you will get concession in uh, you know study abroad services too uh, we won't charge for any consultation we are into canada uk australia denmark finland you are europe we are specifically doing we, we are the major player in uh, punjab uh, were doing europe otherwise mm-hmm. you might have seen people are doing canada uk australia everyone is doing canada uk australia for uh, netherland you are dealing yeah 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 we are into netherland so we do have direct sir, tie ups yes sir in do. europe is it true that there are university that are university that are tuition free yeah in like italy basically in italy if you know italian you have to clear some 
uh, domestic language test. So if you clear those domestic language tests like Germany, in Germany, you can get a free qualification if you clear German test. In Italy, you'll, you will get a free education from a, a public universities if you clear the you know, Italian test. Uh, but if you compare Canadian structure and European structure, there is a huge difference. Like if you just achieve six overall, not less than 5.5, you can go Denmark. Denmark is a wonderful country, second happiest country in the world. And visa success rate is very high. You can even plus two student can take his or her spouse with in Denmark. No other country allow you to take spouse if you are just 12th. Even Canada, UK, Australia, they do not entertain spouse. But Denmark, in Denmark, you can take your spouse with it, even if you are 12. Sir, what and about the tuition fees? Tuition fees in Denmark. So if you are seven, 2017 or 18 pass out, uh, we can give you global trainer program uh, in Denmark. And that is just like you can clear, uh, it's like, uh, including all the expenses, embassy expenses, six month fees, the total expense would be 7.5 to 8 lakh. No GIC is required, no mm -hmm. show money is required, zero show money. Denmark basically uh, exempt the primary applicant to show money, right? Like in U UK, you need to show at least, uh, you know, 15 to 16 lakh, 28 days old. In Australia, you need to show 35, 30, 35 lakh, three months old, right? Canada, you have to basically deposit GIC. In Germany, you have to open a block account, right? But in Denmark, you have to do nothing. Just pay six month fees, embassy fees, case ID fees, apostille, and some other expenses, and you'll be there. So Denmark is going to be a wonderful destination. Uh, less than 20,000 Indians are there yet. And I mean, now we are, uh, you know, uh, filing uh, throughout Punjab, more than 150 files this session. So if you guys any assistance on the European or Canada, UK, Australia, I would say instead of Canada, UK, Australia, go Denmark. This is a very hot destination. If you settle in Denmark today, uh, you'll be settled better over there than Canada in the next five years. You can even bring your family over there. And uh, if you are married, you can take your spouse with. Your spouse will get full-time work. So normally, if you're going to get married, you can you know, uh, put your spouse on study permit and you will get a full-time work. Permit. And you can go same day, same flight. You can settle in Denmark. And uh, you can just check on Google a uh, list of happiest countries in the world. Should I show you? Just give me a second. Let me show you one, uh, some of the facts. You'll be surprised. Okay, just type in, um, type in Google list of happiest countries in the world. Is my screen is visible to all of you? We're similar yes. Yeah, yeah, yes, 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 yes. yes. Okay, so this is basically World Happiness Index. So countries are happiness because uh, this is World Happiness Index 2023. So if you check, Finland is on first number, first happiest country in the world. So why it is happiest? Because welfare, welfare safety, um, you know, economical stability is there, health, welfare, and safety is there. Denmark is on the second spot, Switzerland third. Austria 11th, Australia 11, and then Canada on 14, UK 17. India is on 136, guys. I'll show you. India is on 136. Yeah, here we go. 136. So, Netherlands or Germany? They just see like only Canada. Ah, you can see here. Netherlands is on 5th. Germany is on 13th. Germany is still better than Canada in terms of happiness. But I would say, see, Denmark may visa success rate very good. Um, Germany, ho gaya, Italy, ho gaya, ye bade choosy countries. Hai. Matlab, isme visa success rate. We, we are into Ireland as well. If you want to do Ireland, mein, what you can do, one year 
if you are graduated one year master is there two year work permit is there uh isme jo denmark mein we have uh, courses like three year courses where you'll get part time work permit and after that you'll get two year work permit five year agar aap denmark mein reh jate ho to you'll get indefinite stay wahan pe pr ko indefinite stay bolte hain canada mein wo pr hai wahan pe indefinite stay hai and uh, similarly we are into sweden as well sweden if you are uh, from the you know technical background btech mtech then no requirement of ielts even finland mein ielts ki bhi requirement nahi hai but there are two type of test that you need to clear uh, mostly thode se difficult hote hain we are into switzerland as well uh sweden New Zealand, you need six month old funds. Australia needs three month old funds. Germany is there block account, GIC account. Ireland doesn't need any GIC or, but still it's like, yeah. And after that, guys, you can also just check. You can check average monthly salary in debt. एवरेज एम्प्लॉय इन डेनमार्क आंस डी के के वहां पे डी के के चलता है दैट इज इक्वल एंड टू ऑलमोस्ट ट्वेल्व इंडियन वहां का एक डी के के यहाँ साढ़े ग्यारह बारह है बट वहां पे सैलरी बहुत हायर है एवरेज एम्प्लॉय इन डेनमार्क आंस फोर्टी फाइव थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड एटी वन पर मंथ बिफोर टैक्सेस अगर आपके पास टैक्सेस के बाद थर्टी थाउजेंड भी मिलता है आपको और ट्वेंटी फाइव थाउजेंड भी कमाते हैं तो इट विल बी मोर देन थ्री लैख पर मंथ and that's a pretty handsome income plus you'll get a, a wonderful you know environment if you write down average monthly expenses in denmark you will be surprised so one person one month approximately 7751 dkk approximately 70 to 80 thousand is expenses and you're earning more than you know 3 lakh so this is the best country if you want to live economically and uh, you know better so these and, countries are accepting without ielts uh denmark no you need to clear at least if you are 12th you need to clear overall 6 but they are flexible ek mein saade panch bhi chal jayenge do mein saade panch bhi chal jayenge five will not be acceptable overall 6 not less than 5.5 But if you are graduated, overall six point five, not less than five point five. They are also accepting PT too. Some of the universities. Any other question, guys? No, sir. All clear. So, yes, yeah. Just update me uh, whether you would like to. If you would like to join, just update me on the same uh, WhatsApp. One of our teammate will get back to you. Or you can also call me on this number. You.